Welcome everyone to Carol's Art Room. Well, I'm gonna do a couple of tiles. I usually like to do two the same that makes a matching set for coasters. Pretty soon I'll be done with doing coasters and I'll be doing some bigger, bigger projects. So we'll come back for that. So today's colors, this is a color that I haven't used. I don't even know when, but Modern Masters Ruby. Look at that. And it's metallic. So I'm going to try this in a bloom. And this one is uh, Permanent Magenta by Winsor & Newton. No, not Winsor & Newton, sorry. Amsterdam Primary Magenta. I just mixed this up so there's lots of air bubbles. I'm going to use my favorite Athenia by this little piggy and some fairy floss and uh, might put a little bit of gold too so uh, I think I'll put um, I think I'll put this down first then some Athenia Oh, I guess I need my base, right? I need my base. Consistency. I just made this one up. So metallics sometimes need a little extra liquid. Just uh, they seem to be thicken up easy if you leave them open. All right, that's pretty good. That's a vibrant color, holy moly. I'll put down the Sophenia. I love this color. Look at the gold in there. I hope it shows up. This one, Modern Masters Ruby, Athenia, um, I'll put down some Fairy Floss next. Uh, magenta that still seems thick on me. Gee, this one took a long time to thin out. I'm sure you could take your paint, thin it first, and then add your pouring medium. Thin it with a bit of water and varnish. Okay, I'll try this now. say I wanted gold. No, I'm not going to put the gold in. There's gold already in there. So let's, uh, let's try my cell activator. Let's 
Makes it four to one. Blew out pretty good. I find if my cell activator is a bit thinner, it works. It seems to blow out a little better, obviously. So, oh, that's so pretty. Too much weight there. I got some here too. That's okay. A little bit's okay. Some of them are air bubbles which I was going to torch, and I forgot to torch. that in the middle it's kind of concave so it has to flow back in I'll do another one in the same colors, but I might try a different order, see what happens. All right, I think it might be ready to Okay, so let's spin this out. on this one too I think because it's such a dark color underneath
spin. The colors are gorgeous together. now. I'll give it one more spin. it the way it is. All right. I'm going to come back and do another one. Okay. I'm back to do another red. So this was on the bottom last time. I think I'll switch and I'll put the magenta on the bottom. air bubbles out. Okay, I'll put some Athenia. Fairy floss. And now my 
This is the ruby red. Wow, it's so dark. And thick. use white and black cell activator. Should have done it the last one. It makes such nice cells with the white around it. Okay. All right, so where's my cell activator? Here it is. Amsterdam titanium white. And oxide black. I did it again. <laughs> always one spot. Always, always. Yeah, see the white ring around the cells? Pretty. I'll let this uh, come back in the middle. basement with my art room and my husband's in the other room he's been working on the family room a family room so he's just finishing up finished up the ceiling and now he's tidying up so that's what you can hear that's very pretty same colors as the other one but just in that middle. It's kind of an odd shape. This is going to take a while to... ready to spin.
Wow, so pretty. I got too much weight there. Let's just move it a little bit. I love these stripey lines. See if I can get some of that white to come down. it back. Stretch it back this way a little bit. I'll give it another spin. Quite different than the other one, that's for sure. Quite different. Maybe I'll show you the other one beside it. This one's stretched out more, I think. This one has more gold showing than this one at all. There's some here. See? Wow. And I, I only switched two colors, the top and the bottom colors. But this had white cell activator and this just had black. I love them both. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, everybody, and come back to Carol's Art Room. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and hit the bell for notifications. And I'll put these dry results at the end of the video. Have a good day. Hi, everyone. Here's my dried tiles. They dried really good. That one's so pretty. They're both pretty. I love them. Thanks for watching and uh, have a great day. Bye-bye.